today I'm going to be doing my product review on the Top Fin 20. <coughs> this is the one that came with my 20 gallon starter kit. And this is the second one that I bought to go along with it for extra filtration. So the only difference between the two is obviously the cover. I'm going to put this to the side somewhere. The newer one, the one that I bought extra, just has a slimmer cover and also, hold on, let me check and see if you can see this. <clears throat> okay, this one comes with a foam insert right here and the cartridge slides into the back of it. There's little holders on the back of the foam and the cartridge goes inside. I added this foam piece onto the original one and uh, with the cartridge behind it which is it's kind of a tight squeeze but it, it works just fine and um, also I use the uh, Tetra brand cartridges as replacement I don't know if you can notice but the plastic pieces say top fin but that's because I only use the frame that came with the initial filter itself but I use the Tetra um, replacement cartridges which just has the uh, white foam cartridge, you know, what they're typically made out of filter floss, and then it comes with individual bags of carbon that you pour inside, and then you just clip them back on. Um, both intake tubes, they, uh, I don't know if you can see this quite well, but they come apart. Half about halfway down the tube, and I, they both are are exactly the same, even though they are two different. I wouldn't say models, but two slightly different versions. They have adjustable flows on both, with pointing well towards you at the moment would be full power, which is what I have both mine on, and away would be of course the lowest. Um. Aside from the opening where the tube comes apart, there is only one other way you can open it to clean it, which would be on the knob itself. You, you can pull the knob out to scrub it. I use a toothbrush, which isn't quite manageable since it's not flexible. I can't reach all the all the gunk that may be built up inside the intake tube. You can see it had a little bit of algae. But otherwise, they perform very well. Very good filtration. Um, a lot of other reviews say that they get the motors go out or stuff breaks, but they seem very sturdy. Not very flimsy at all, really. Um, they move a lot of water. Um, very good filters. Although I wouldn't buy them for a big tank, like a 55, I don't think I would go for the top fin. 60 first, I would probably go for more on Marine Land Bio Wheel, um, or maybe even an, aqu an Aqua Clear. But otherwise, very good filter for my 20 gallon that I have. And uh, I don't have top fin for my 10 gallon, but that's my 10 gallon. I'm upgrading to a 45 soon, and I have my bio wheel right there ready to go. And that is my review for the Top Fin 20. Very good filters, move a lot of water. I'll show you the water here quick. Move a lot of water. About 200% filtration for what I need, which is good because extra filtration is always good. But otherwise, that's about it. Thanks.